folks, Dr. Mary Warren here with Road Warrior Wellness and Wheels Up Wellness. Hey, today I'd like to talk with you a few minutes about fatigue and how it negatively impacts our body. I'm a pretty positive person, but I'm very well aware of how draining energetically and physically fatigue can be. Whether you're in the aviation industries or your meeting planners, people that are very involved with travel, travel industry, or you're someone who is simply living your life out in the world, world working or parenting and or doing all the things that so many millions of us do every day. Fatigue definitely drags us down. So a couple of things that are really helpful for quenching fatigue are getting a good night's sleep. I'm a big fan of getting to bed about the same time every night. Ideally, you want between seven and a half, seven and eight hours of sleep every night. <clears throat> and try to get those bedrooms and sleeping spaces or hotel rooms as dark and as quiet as possible. Um, unplug things, cover things up, move things around, close those curtains, you know, paper clip the curtains or bobby pin the curtains or, you know, whatever you need to do to get your curtains and so that they're not, you know, showing light through them. And then that way, when you get up in the morning, you're more likely to feel refreshed. So if you're a coffee drinker, you absolutely have that first cup of coffee in the morning. <clears throat> and then during the course of the day, you can then switch over to green tea and water. Why green tea? Well, green tea, of course, has the lowest amount of caffeine of all the caffeinated drinks. And it has... Um, it's really good for quenching free radicals. So it has good antioxidant levels in as well. I'm a big fan of drinking both uh, organic coffee and organic green tea. And I'm also a big fan, as most of you know, of water. Water is a great way to help overcome fatigue. Most of the time, people are less hydrated than we think we are. So try to keep yourself hydrated within the course of the day. Um, I did not plan to be color coded today, but as it turns out, I am. I love this bottle. It's a great color and it fits my hand really well. It's nice and slim. It's 750 milliliters. And I normally have had two of these by dinner time during the course of the day. And then I'll have a couple of glasses of water at home uh, in the morning morning and in the evening uh, in addition to my bottles of water. So really keep your bodies well hydrated. Remember that caffeine dehydrates the body. Why? Because it's diuretic. So the stronger the caffeine, the more diuretic it causes uh, in the body. So keep yourself well hydrated, get lots of sleep, try to offload your stress, and, um, and it will definitely help your fatigue. All right, my road warriors, I hope you are healthy, healthy, and I hope you're all about the wellness. I'll see you next time. Bye.